How you guys? Welcome back to my channel, Planning and Teaching. Today is an exciting day. It is the last plan with me in my mini happy planner for 2017. Um, and make sure you stay tuned for next the next post because it's really, really exciting where I talk about what worked in 2017 and what didn't and how I'm going to look for planner peaks in 2018. So I'm going to go ahead and pop out this week. Now, I'm going to do something a little bit different. If you don't follow Kill of a Plan, what are you thinking? Go follow Kill of a Plan. Um, she made a really good point. This week is split into two because of um, New Year's Eve on Sunday and Monday is Christmas. So what I'm going to do to basically... Um, split this week in half by putting a board in between the two. So to separate my two holidays, I used two pieces of scrapbook paper, one that um, was Christmassy and the other one that was kind of representing New Year's. And I used a insert from my mini happy planner to measure out my pieces and I cut them down to size using my cutter. Then I used my tape roller, my adhesive roller to put them together and then I used my alphabet sticker book to put hello 2018 on one side and I did that um utilizing uh, a piece from my week to kind of measure and keep the letter straight I wish I had bigger letters but I didn't so I had to work with what I had currently and then um on the Christmas side I just pulled out some seasonal stickers from the seasonal sticker book um, that says season's greetings, a wreath, and some lights to separate um, the two and to make them stand out. And this way I can separate my two holidays. So now we're ready to decorate. So when I punch these, it's going to be separated like so. Okay, so let's get started. I'm gonna start by decorating my Christmas. So I'm gonna be in that seasonal sticker book, just trying to kind of see um, what I like and what I don't like. All right, so I do love this Christmas here. So I'm gonna hold that. Um, Hmm. Right, I'm gonna just go with Christmas right here, and then I'm gonna just grab the um, some of these presents here. Uh oh, messed that up a little bit. I'm gonna grab these presents and just kind of lay them. Here, and then I'm going to grab these green ones and kind of lay them catty corner there. And I'm going to grab this Christmas tree and place it right here. Okay. All right. And then the next thing I'm going to look for are some boxes so I can kind of make a few plans. I'm gonna go with this one, two, three, four, five, six box and I'm gonna put it in between Wednesday. And Thursday. Um, on those but on my sheets that I have I have some sheets I'm gonna see what we have Let's see. let me 
these little snowmen, these little snow globes are so, so adorable. So I'm gonna pick up my tree just a little bit. Loose them up just a little bit, not too much. And then lay that down and then it's like rotate it back on top of there. Um, I'm gonna pull up this gold Christmas. And I'm going to lay down this um, really pretty decorative Merry Christmas right on top there. Okay. Um, and um, it's not really, it's cold, but it's not too cold in Mississippi. So I'm not going to put any of the snow here, but I'm going to put a deck the halls. I'm going to put it over here in the green area on top of the other stickers because I think that's so cute on top. Okay. Then just right on top of my snow globes, I'm going to put this because I'm not doing anything on Tuesday but relaxing. And then now we're ready to talk about these. So I'm gonna grab the productivity sticker book. Actually, I'm gonna grab the mom sticker book. And I'm gonna put going to put this sticker out beside my numbers there for today and I need another one that says today yeah. all right in my productivity sticker book Actually, let's look in the basics. I'm going to grab this today's plans. And I'm going to grab a box. I'm gonna grab a box, even though this says what's for dinner, I'm gonna grab this box, put it here and lay right on top of it, today's plans. Cute, all right, so that is the Christmas side. So let's talk about New Year's. All right, so I'm going to just grab a box for my color story that's black and gold or some, I right, some very close to that. Let's see if we can find one. See, these are black and rose gold, so I don't want those. I used a lot of the black and white. All right, so really quickly, if you're having this type of problem where your pages are coming out, my suggestion would be to cut this. nice and neat 
put the string through the opening here and give it two to three good knots nice and tight one more to kind of hold your pages in and you can still kind of you can still flip through and do whatever you need to do so let's see okay we got a black and white that'll work so let me grab this And I'm going to put it right here. And then I'm going to grab the New Year sticker. Let me see what I have in my seasonal first. The seasonal should have a New Year's page, but I don't think it does. It has celebrating the dates and holidays yeah. but it doesn't have a sheet dedicated to New Year's definitely need one of those I do like these really, really cute um, New Year's hats. So I'm going to lay those here. There is a gold one and a black one. So I'm going to put both of those there. It says Happy New Year. That's cute. And then I'm going to move this black one to the other side. And I'm going to cover up that pink note with this one that says today. Okay. Um, I also want to utilize this pop clink is so I'm in the quote sticker book and I'm going to just utilize this pop clink and fizz and I'm going to place it right here how cute I'm going to look in my sticker book for any clear quotes yes I think this is it there's a few more let me look And all of my little sticker books seem to be kind of tearing up. So, let's see. This God is Love sticker. So I'm gonna pull that and lay it here. It's the last day of the year, and it's a blessing that it falls on a Sunday. I will definitely be in church. I hope you guys will be going attending as well. All right. 
I'm also going to lay down another box from my color story sticker book. If I can find one that will work. Yeah. I have this golden white one here. And then on top of that one, I'm going to add in this black and white today sticker. Mm. It's going to cover up on Saturday, so I'm going to cut off the bottom of it. And put it here. Um, Saturday needs a small checklist, and I have a few, but I don't know, I don't think I have a gold one in here, but it may be a black one in here somewhere, let's see. Yep, I got this black one here. I'm going to grab it, and I'm going to grab the sticker that says errands that I saw in here. Yep. So I'm going to and what I'm doing is like cutting A new flag into this followed by an, and putting an errands label on top for any errands I need to run on, on Saturday and I think that's going to wrap up my plan with me I wanted I was hoping that I had a sticker that had like this really pretty, um, that looked like a firework sticker, but I don't think I have one of those. What I am going to do though, is I'm looking at this dashboard that I created. And I'm going to put, this gold I'm gonna put this golden black sticker right on top that says one day at a time and on the back of here I'm going to put a red sticker I have a red clear sticker Today is the day it has some really pretty stickers and I believe it has some clear yes and it has some really pretty gold stickers in here too but I am looking for like a red sticker or green It's kind of festive. And the seasonal doesn't have anything like that, I don't think, for Christmas. They have a baby, it's cold outside sticker, but that doesn't really apply.
I like this one. Good things take time. And I am getting this out of the color coordinated book. This is the first time I've used something out of here, I believe, in a very long time. So, yeah. All right, you guys. I'm going to quickly punch this and come right back. All right, you guys, so that's gonna wrap up um, my plan with me, my last and final plan with me. Um, check it out on Friday to see a, um, after the pin spread. Let me pop this in and pop this in. And pop in my dashboard. And there you have it, you guys. Christmas, New Year's. Love it. Love it. Great idea, kill of a plan. Um, mine didn't turn out as bright and pretty as hers because I don't have any of those chunky letters. I wish I did. But I absolutely love it. I can see it. It's good enough for me. It works. Um, like I said, stay tuned because I have another video coming up this week. Instead of a Teacher Tuesday video, I have a Talk Tuesday where I kind of talk about some things that um, worked well for me in 2017 and what didn't work well for me. And what um, I'm not going to talk about what's going on in 2018 um, until I do my 2018 planner lineup. And that will be coming out um, probably Thursday, Friday. Um, and I will be doing all my planner setups this week as well. So stay tuned for all of those um, as I get ready to get started with my 2018 year. So you guys, keep God first in everything you do. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe. It's absolutely free. I have some giveaways coming up for the next five days. So please make sure that you are subscribed. Tell someone about me and um, check out my Instagram if you're not following me at planning and teaching I my goal is to get to 200 followers there and 400 on my YouTube channel before 2018 so help me do that by sharing um, the link help me to do that by sharing the link to my YouTube page as well as the link to my Instagram page and once again it's planning and teaching for both of those also if you're a teacher go check me out on the classy sexy teacher where I also feature some of my plan with me videos as well as things that I have going on in my classroom so once again you guys thanks so much for watching be safe this holiday enjoy your Christmas and remember that Jesus is the reason for the season and I will see you in the next video. Happy planning and teaching you guys. Bye.